Hi folks, Rob Cosman. I'm making what's called a mushroom. Let me show you what it is. It's like that. It goes in a one inch hole in your bench and then that half inch hole takes the end of your bench lamp. And that's a fragile piece. So instead of using the half inch part and which eventually breaks, that fits into the mushroom, the entire mushroom turns. I try to make these so we don't have to use any sandpaper. Typically you cut the end of it, of that round piece, by using your skew chisel like this. However, it takes a lot of work because you can't force it through nearly as aggressively as the way I'm about to show you. Flip it over, use the point. I was taught this by Dale Nish, and it's amazing how you can power through a piece of wood. Now this is a piece of Eastern maple, so it's not exactly soft. Get it close, then turn around, and I can come in and do my finish cut with my chisel held the other way, and that eliminates the need for any sandpaper.